New at noon, a local restaurant is an opening today after vandals viciously targeted the small business. The windows, restaurant supplies, and a circuit breaker all destroyed at La Presa Cafe. That's just south of downtown. After speaking with the owner, Case at 12's Josh Skernick shows us this could be a personal vendetta. They did not want us to be open today. It was obvious. The broken signs, smashed shakers creating a sea of salt and sugar. Whoever trashed the place didn't want any goods. The goal was to make it hurt. It seemed like a, like a target. It didn't seem random. Uh, anything that came to the charm of the cafe. We had a, a piñata that they destroyed for no reason. We had a poster given to us by children at the local high school. Only stealing paintings made by owner Norma Gomez's sister. Everybody in the neighborhood knows them. When the staff of La Presa Cafe, just south of downtown, walked in around 6 a.m., they found the refrigerators unplugged, a smashed circuit breaker and iPad, leaving them and the neighbors to clean up the mess. The five-month-old restaurant won't make anything anytime soon. They came in through a window, so they punched glass and it went flying. Gomez, a former electrical engineer who's now living her dream of owning a restaurant, she says she's had a year of harassment and has a hunch of who did the personal attack. There had been somebody that you, well, I don't really want to say. Okay. The, I'm, it's a safety issue of my own no, myself. She is asking for any tips on what happened overnight. Now, one possible lead is a security camera across the street at the senior center. They're checking on it right now to see what they can find. Yeah. And this got torn up into pieces. The vandals leaving a blood trail and fingerprints. Gomez is looking for an electrician to get them up and running. The ability to run her business in peace would be good too. Josh Gurnick, KSAT 12 News.